We are here to answer the not very age old, but in fact very new question of how to use movable type. Very simple. The first thing you need to do is go to the website that you have been given to be an administrator. Then very simply you enter your username, which in this case is going to be admin, just happens to be for this particular site. And then after you've entered that, then you also enter your password. Now hopefully you were given whatever the password might have been so that you can figure out how to get in there. If you don't know what your password is, it can't help you very much from that stage. But if you forget your password, typically there's an option there to click on Forgot Your Password at the bottom. If you click on that, you should be able to have it sent to your email address. Once you've entered that username and password, you simply log in by entering those two, clicking on Sign In. First thing that will happen is you're invited to be welcomed to the new installation of the site. Not really a big deal. You can leave that there, you can follow that through. It has some explanation about different things that you can do. It will actually walk you through the different steps of doing things like how to work through things. It gives you an idea here through the online manual of what you can do. I personally don't need that, so I'm going to close that out because it's just taking up space on the screen that's not really of use to me. So then all you have to do is go up to your user dashboard up in the upper left hand corner of the page. And when it gives you the option, you need to pick whichever blog it is that you are responding to or that you're using to publish something new. Usually it'll give you a list of options, those blogs on which you are an approved user. So you click on whichever one that is. In this case, we'll call it the Parish News link. We'll scroll on down to that one, click the link, and it allows you then to see the full list of what the entries are that have been in the past, how frequently things have been put up here. You can look at other statistics about things that people have put up as entries, as comments and tags and so forth. Most of that's not important. You just need to go click on Entries, which is again in the upper left hand corner. Click on New to create a new entry. Once you've clicked on that, you allow the system to load the new section. And there we're off to the races. Create the entry, title of the entry. I'm just going to call it title of the entry. Click in whatever the body of the message is. Describe whatever it is that you're talking about. We'll just say blah, blah, blah. Then when you're done entering whatever it is there, best to leave it in as minimal a set of text formats as possible. In other words, don't underline, don't bold, don't do any of that stuff unless you absolutely have to. Just type in the information. Uh, let the formatting take care of itself. Then you go down and add a tag or two if you want. These are usually pretty helpful. These let you describe what it is that people are looking at. So here we're going to say it's, let's just say it was about a particular event. You describe what the event is down here in just one or two words. Separate those out with commas. So if it had been about an ice cream social, you might enter ice cream and you might enter social. And you simply separate those with commas, very simple. Enter that down in the tags field at the bottom. And you scroll over here to where it says publishing. You can preview it if you want. You can save a draft if you want. Most of the time, you can just go ahead and click publish and put it up. That's all that you have to do to add a new entry. And that's in whatever blog you've chosen. Make sure you select that carefully so that you know which one it's in. But that's really all it takes. And then when it's done, you get a green bar here at the top that says the entry's been saved. You can view it by clicking on the link that says view entry. It'll take you to whatever it was. Here you can see our brand new entry. It's nothing all that exotic or interesting, but for the time being, it's a very simple way to share that information with others. And if you have any questions, you just let me know.